I always was the child with the abundance mindset. And when I was younger, and I told this story on Holop Show, and I'll tell it again. I remember going to Key Food, old school for you, and buying like a big box of Jello pudding pops, and going into the hood, my part of the hood, and just handing out ice cream to everybody. That's what I like doing. I always like giving. I always like because I felt like if I could bring people together, that we would all be a part of one. And so when I when I when I began to join these organizations. What I found out was, is that the average person that would become a part of the organization was looking to take a part and run away. He was looking to take a part and take his side and leave. And I never kind of understood that until I really started investigating the scarcity mindset. And I realized this person really thinks that there's limited resources. And so here's the thing. Here's where the abundant uh, uh, scarcity mindset kind of extends. Here you are, you're not a part of the BIO. Maybe you're just a person that's on the fringes and you're with your mindset where you say, I'm waiting to see what they do. Ever heard that before, brothers? <laughs> I'm waiting to see what they do. I'm waiting. Y'all can call me when y'all get something popping over here. Y'all can call me when y'all finally get it together. And when you do that, who the fuck thinks you, what makes you think we gonna call you? <laughs> what makes you think that if you wasn't a part of the building, now we gonna call your black ass knowing that you was hovering around? And what that means is, is you have at the basic level, you have a black nationalist scarcity mindset. BAIO, Black African Infrastructure Organization, it's all about abundance. It's the fact that we understand that Africa is not the size of Texas, you idiot that Africa is three three times the size of America. And you would say, Chinese are gobbling up land in Africa. What does that make you think? Does that make you think there's like a square left there? <laughs> does that make you think that there's, there's just a tile left, like a ceiling tile left there? Or did you really understand when they said it's three times the size of America? And did you really understand that nobody's ever gonna claim every square inch of that continent? And did you really understand that there are certain countries, nations within that country that are willing to negotiate with you, not only let you build on their land, but show you how to build in places that they would select and they would help you build it. But you guys, you come to us with this scarcity mindset. And the reason why you do is because all your life, all you've dealt with is scarcity.